owners of the Deepwater Horizon oil rig have agreed to pay $1.4 billion in penalties for the 2010 Gulf of Mexico oil spill. An explosion aboard the rig killed 11 workers and triggered a spill of almost 5 million barrels of oil. In a deal with the U.S. Justice Department, Transocean Deepwater will plead guilty to violating the U.S. Clean Water Act. Transocean will pay $400 million to resolve criminal charges and another $1 billion in civil fines. It was the biggest oil spill and one of the largest environmental disasters in U.S. history. An explosion at the Deepwater Horizon oil rig in April 2010 caused nearly 5 million barrels worth of oil to leak into the Gulf of Mexico. 11 people died on the rig and it took five months for the leaking Macondo well to be firmly sealed. By that time, marshes, beaches and fishing grounds had fallen victim to the oil. The British oil company BP, which was leasing the Deepwater Horizon, has already agreed to pay billions in fines, though its liability may not finish there. But the rig itself was owned by Transocean, and its engineers were running the day-to-day -day operation under the direction of BP. Both companies were accused of ignoring warning signs that an explosion caused by natural gas was imminent. The announcement from the U.S. Department of Justice that Transocean will pay nearly $1.5 billion isn't the end of the matter, though. The company hasn't settled with a committee that represents more than 100,000 individuals and businesses who say they suffered from the spill. And there's a third company involved, Halliburton, which supplied the concrete seal around the well, but which has denied that it played any part in the disaster. BP says Halliburton must accept a share of the blame. Meanwhile, the news of the multi-billion dollar fine caused Transocean's shares to rise by over 6% because the amount the company will pay is actually less than it budgeted for.